to edit or not to edit? That is the question. And during the month of November, the answer to that question is a big fat no! What's up my nerds, it is The Circulation Desk and I am taking a small break from trying to catch up with my NaNoWriMo word count and rewatching the 200th episode of Supernatural for the 200th time to beat some information over your head. Again, broken record be damned. Let's just get it out there. Under absolutely no circumstances are you to send your manuscript, your NaNoWriMo manuscript, to agents or editors or publishers, your mom, or even beta readers on December 1st. It won't be ready yet. And if you do send it out, you're not going to get the kind of feedback that will actually help you. One key component of making it out of the month of November as a NaNoWriMo warrior is turning the edit feature off on both the software that you use and your brain. And this rule doesn't just apply to NaNo. Realistically, you should be doing this for all first drafts because you can't edit what isn't written even if the edit feature on the software that you're using doesn't show up with having any spelling errors or grammatical errors, it doesn't mean it's polished. It doesn't really mean anything, actually. I mean, not only do you have the words that spell check isn't going to catch because they're spelled correctly, but they're either in the wrong place or it's the wrong word entirely. But you also have things that no automated machine is going to pick up on, like plot holes, character development, continuity errors. They are things that you are going to have to find and fix all by yourself. Come December 1st, you still have a long way to go before your manuscript should be introduced to the world. There is no one writer, no matter how amazing they are, can churn out a perfect manuscript on the first draft. It's not going to happen. There is always, always, always going to be something to edit. A very large portion of things that you read every single day have been edited multiple times. December 1st doesn't mean that you're done with your book, it just means that you're done with NaNo. My recommendation, just to make sure you're really there, is to make three passes on your manuscript before considering sending it out to beta readers. The first pass I do is called the big picture pass. This is when you read through your manuscript and you only focus on the big picture items like world building and plot. Your plot is the key thing that you want to be focusing on on this pass. You want to make sure that there's no loose ends and that there's no plot holes, that everything is fluid and everything makes sense. The second pass that I like to make is for smaller scale items like character development and subplots. Making sure that the characters' personalities aren't exactly the same throughout the book, but are consistent. We expect them to grow throughout the story, so at the end they're probably a little bit different than they are in the beginning, and that's fine as long as the growth is shown to us through the story. And finally, the third pass is the line edit. This is where I go through and I literally focus sentence to sentence, looking for grammatical errors, spelling mistakes, awkward structure. On my third pass, I'm not worried about what is happening so much in my book as I am with the words actually on the page. Is your manuscript going to be perfect after those three passes? Most likely not. You can only do so much as the writer. It always helps to have someone else read through and give you their advice because they may see something, a huge gaping plot hole that you didn't even realize because you're too close to the project. So before I send my manuscript out, that's three passes minimum that I like to make. I know for a fact that I'm going to be making plenty more passes after I get my manuscript back from my beta readers. That's to be expected. After your manuscript has gone through several rounds of different types of beta readers, then, own only then, when you are absolutely confident that that is the best work that you can do, do you send it to agents or editors or publishers. And that's my two cents. Thank you for watching, and I will see you on Sunday.